What's up you lot, welcome back to Poker Collection. I am back with some Unbroken Bonds build and battle pre-release deck boxes. Happy Unbroken Bonds release. Um, normally I kick off each set with pre-release deck boxes, but uh, this time I thought I'd do two instead of the one. Um, and actually, I didn't actually have one for Team Up, so um, those recordings you haven't seen by the way, because they I've only just finished recording them and there was a delay because that set was released just as we were moving and I've and just as I finished recording those last week uh, Unbroken Bonds got released as well so I thought let's prioritize Unbroken Bonds give you guys a break between that you know between team up and everything um, but it'll be a nice little sort of uh, balance between you know Unbroken Bonds team up and the tins that I have coming up and also some giveaways too so stay tuned and follow me on pokercollection.com by the way if you go to pokercollection.com now you will actually find several different links to my social channels so you know where to find me on YouTube, Twitch, uh, Instagram, Facebook, all that sort of stuff, all on one link. So PokerCollection.com is all you need to remember now and things will change based on new events and stuff, maybe even giveaway links. Um, so definitely visit that, it's very cool, it's one, one page with all my links to social and it's awesome because it makes it easier for you to get to any giveaways across social. Uh, but yeah, awesome stuff. So, um, Unbroken Bonds, I have not seen much of the set at all except for the uh, Charizard and Reshiram uh, GX, uh, Tag Team GX. So, pretty much everything in this set is really new to me. From what I know, it has about 234 cards or something. Let me have a quick look. Um, yeah, 234 cards, which is shy of two cards of Lost Thunder, which is the biggest set. It's a huge set, this one, and it's going to be almost impossible to complete. But I'm still going to collect the cards, I guess. I should probably stop doing the Master Sets, but anyway. Now, I can't remember what the promotional cards for this was, so um, everything's a surprise. Um, and I don't know what to expect, really. So we'll see how we go. Alright, so hopefully I'll get different promotional cards in each. So let's see which one I've got here. So, ooh, I've got Volcanion in this one. That's really cool. So Volcanion, and you obviously in this in this pre-release deck box or build and battle boxes, you get 40 cards which are already part of the deck, I think. Or 20 cards, I think. Sorry. The 20 cards? A 23 card evolution pack. That's what it is. And then you also get four... Uh, booster packs as well, uh, which allows you to customize each deck um, every time you go to pre-release. So it gives you guys a fair, a fair um, sort of ground to play in uh, if you don't actually build your own decks like me. I don't play competitively, but we've got a little flyer here, so that's pretty cool. Um, so yeah, it contains a 23 card evolution pack, four booster packs from Unbroken Bonds, and some energy as well. So um, cool, awesome. Right, so let's check out the evolution pack first. Um, of course, we've got the Volcanion um, promotional card and the TCG code card to go with it as well. So let's just get the um, let's just get that out. So that's the. Oh, let's focus here. So that's the Unbroken Bonds promo there, SM179. I'm glad they started to make these um, promotional cards again. Okay, and then we've got, I think, probably a combination of cards from this set and other sets. So um, we've got Welder, uh, Lily, How, Pokemon Communication, Litten, a few of those, Toracat, Incineroar, which is a rare, a Red's Challenge, Lily, Looker, skateboard. Ooh, meow. That looks cute. Uh, Goldine, seeking. Nice. And then we've got a TCG code card as well. Um, right. So I'll put that over here. Right. So let's check out the. This is pretty much the first time I'm going to be looking at this set. So I'm really excited about seeing what I get hold of in this. Ugh. Right. So, oh, I've got one of each pack. I love that. That's really cool. One of each pack. By the way, welcome to my new set. You haven't seen the team up set yet, but um, that's coming as well. So you'll actually get a mixture of sets now, which is kind of cool. Um, but Unbroken Ones is one of my favorites actually this year because it's really colorful. Um, but I do like the artwork. I do still prefer the team up artwork of Mimikyu and Gengar. But um, this is still very, very cool. Now, apparently this set um, reintroduces baby Pokemon. I read something about that, but we'll see. All right, okay, let's see. Let's start a new set. Okay, we have an Ekans, and we're off to a nice start. 
that's pretty cool. A Kavana, Clefairy, Litten, Seal, Fairy Energy, Metal Core Barrier, Fire Crystal, Devolution Spray, Zed. Ooh, Oddish. Little chubby looking um, Oddish there. And Incineroar here as well. So that could easily become part of my playset if I was to make a deck out of a pre release deck box. I still call them pre released uh, deck boxes. It's just kind of a reflex, but it's now called a Build and Battle. Maybe because if they run out, they can. Sorry, if they have overstock, they can probably sell it still. Who knows? But anyway, let's have a look. Okay, so we. Ooh, this is a really cute looking Mistrevis. Very happy there. Um, we got a Glamiel, Growlithe, some really cool Pokemon. Oh my gosh, Ghastly. Very nice. Togepi. I really love that artwork too. Water Energy, Poke Gear 3.0, Malane, Giovanni's Exile, a Rhyhorn, a Reverse, and a Rhyperior. It looks like it's marching. That's quite nice. Again, Kawaii is just amazing in their artwork. It just brings even the Pokemon I'm not a huge fan of um, to life, really. Does something that I really like. I have to be honest with you, though. Unbroken Bonds as a logo. <laughs> Probably one of the more bo boring ones. Um, sorry to wh whoever designed that. But uh, but I, I guess I preferred the, um, the first team up. Okay, we got Diglett. Uh, Poliwag, Inkay, Tentacool, Drowsy, <laughs> it's very slouched, uh, Darkness Energy, Metapod, a Fero, a Graveler, very, very Kanto-y, a Spiro Reverse, and a Hypno. Very cool. Okay, so mostly just rares at the moment. Let's see if anything changes in this pack. So yeah, normally I get two of the sorry, one of these build of matter boxes each set, but I thought I'd get two this time. Because why not? Alright, we've got Esper, uh, Porygon, Daramaka, Caterpie, Cottony, Lightning Energy, Electric Energy, Dust Island, Golbat, a Tentacruel, a Quagsire Reverse Rare, and a Dug Trio Rare. So just rares in that box there, but let's see what we get in the second one. We'll just go straight into it. Hopefully I get a the different promo though. That's the main goal. Got to do so well with these. And it looks like I might have the same one. Yeah, it's the same one, Volcanion. So I've got two of them. Boom. Okay, well, I'll just open the four booster packs anyway. Um, I always get doubles if I do get if I do open two. That's a bit of a shame. And once, oh no, we almost got all, all four designs there. Okay, let's hope hopefully this this will turn out better then. In terms of the pulls, apparently this is going to be so hard to get all the full arts and the secret rares in this. It's just going to be a headache. Okay, we've got Ekans, uh, Kavana. <gasps> oh my God, we've got something good in this one. It's Clefairy, Litten, Seal, Fairy Energy. Togetic, oh that's so cute, I like this one. Again, Sui is one of my favourites too. Uh, Fairy Charm, Electric, uh, Crocorock, Grub in Reverse, and it is a Full Art Haunts Crow GX. That is my first GX from the set, that is incredible and very, very cool. Nice, I approve. Okay, that is a nice start, and it's a Full Art as well, so right, right, right there. Straight to the point. Okay, so tell me, guys, have you have you been to pre-releases lately, or are you going to be getting some of these boxes or packs or anything? Let me know in the comments below, and let, and uh, let me know what your favorite pulls are from from the video too. Um, okay, we've got Rhyhorn, uh, Meltan. Oh, that's cool, Meltan. Slowpoke. That's a very nice Slowpoke. A Wooper. I love this artwork here. Sandile, um, Water Energy, Graveler, Metal Core Barrier, Fire Crystal, a Cubone Reverse, and a Polyrath. I'm really digging the the uh, the artwork in the set. It's very cute. I just love the different art styles as well. Quite diverse. Hmm. What pack would be my favourite in terms of design? I think it's either the Gardevoir Sylveon or the Machamp. Um, oh my gosh, Marshadow. But I'm not sure. It's very difficult. I think I like the balance of the Sylveon and Gardevoir because of the colour, which is weird. But, I don't know. What do you guys think? Um, Alright, we've got Rattata, Goldeen, Diglett, Alolan Diglett, Slowpoke, Litten, 
Darkness Energy Fero Charger Bug, a Puku Muku, <laughs> like a, a sewn one, a Graveler Reverse, and a Perugly. Not sure about this artwork. <laughs> very, very odd. Okay, so a lot of rares, no hollows, just one full art. I guess that's better than none. So that's pretty cool. Not not too bad of a start, I guess. Um, but let's let's finish with this last pack. Uh, so we've got a Do Duo, Rhyhorn, Meltan, Firo, Spiro. Sorry, this is a nice Spiro. Uh, Lickdung, Electric Energy, Samson Oak, Porygon Two. Okay, this is one of my favourite artworks already. I think it's because of uh, the space design in the back that reminds me of my room when I was growing up mum mother collection she painted my room with glow in the dark uh, stuff and these stickers and stuff and then I had stars up on the ceiling and oh my gosh those are the days I kind of wish I still had them <laughs> okay right we got Do Dodrio um, a Raiolu reverse and oh another Perugly a double Perugly oh Oh well. Okay guys, let me know what your favourite pull was in the comments below. I've got something in my eye, so I'm going to go and I'll see you next time. Um, look out for some really cool giveaways and openings coming up very soon. Until then, bye.